Welcome to another Business Tech Planet video. Today, we'll show you how to make a document read only in SharePoint. First, we'll open and protect the file in Microsoft Word and Excel. Then we'll edit user permissions in SharePoint to make files and folders read only. If you want to make a SharePoint file read only, you can do that by protecting the document. To protect a workbook in the web version of Excel, click Review at the top. Then select Manage Protection. A navigation pane will open on the right. There, click the toggle under Protect Sheet. Now, when you try to edit a cell, you'll see a notification stating that the sheet is protected. Any user can unprotect the sheet by selecting Pause Protection at the top. And once you've finished editing, you can click Resume Protection. To prevent other users from unprotecting the sheet, click Sheet Protection Password. Then enter a password. Make it easy to remember, or write it down, because if you lose the password, you can only recover the data by copying it to a new sheet. With a password enabled, you'll now be asked to enter it whenever you try to pause protection. In the desktop version of Excel, head to Review at the top. Then select Protect Workbook. If you don't enter a password, anyone can unprotect the sheet. Otherwise, enter a memorable password to prevent other users from making edits. Now click OK. Enter the password again to confirm, then hit OK again. Although you can't protect a Word document in the web version, you can in the desktop application. To do that, click Review at the top. Then go to Protection. And restrict editing. Now click the checkbox under Editing Restrictions. Leave the restrictions set to No Changes. Then head down and click the Start Enforcing Protection button. You can now choose to enter a password in the dialog box. Or select User Authentication, so that only document owners can make edits. When you're done, hit OK. To create view-only files in SharePoint, you'll need to edit the permissions for specific files or folders. To do that, open your SharePoint site, and click on Documents in the left menu. Then head up to the top right and click the Settings icon. Now select Site Permissions in the right navigation pane. Then head down and click Advanced Permission Settings. On the next page, you should see a yellow notification box. In there, click Show these items. Then select Manage Permissions next to the Documents folder. To restrict editing for all files in the Documents folder, hit the checkbox next to Members. Then head up and click Edit User Permissions. On the next page, check the box next to Read, and uncheck the box next to Edit. Then hit OK at the bottom. To set a specific file to view only, click Show these items again. Now select Manage Permissions next to the file. Again, select Members, then head up and click Edit User Permissions. Unselect Edit, and select Read instead. Then hit OK to finish. That's all for this video. We hope it was helpful. Check the description for additional links and resources and leave a comment below if you have any concerns or questions. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more Microsoft videos.